Welcome to Droppy, where we take your dumb ideas and make even dumber drawings. I'm Jacob. It's a me, Nathan. It's a me, Karina. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, Yoshi. <laughs> what about Julia? I'm here as Julia. <laughs> Julia fell off the level. Yeah. She was going down a pipe. Thankfully, Yoshi was here to pick up the slack. <laughs> you might notice if you check the freaking date on this one. We're coming in right under the wire of the Mario movie. That's right. We planned it. Wow. wow. Yes. We planned one ahead of time. And and <laughs> as a result, you've got this episode where we ask the question many of you maybe have been thinking, what if Mario movie made by a different studio? What if that? Can you what imagine? Imagine it now, and then we'll we'll bring your imaginings to reality in this speed draw that we did. Yes. Isn't that crazy? Wild. Yes. Wahoo! Nathan, you sound like you want to go first. Yoshi. Let's a go. What Yosh. studio? Yosh. <laughs> what studio did you translate Mario into? Disney. Disney. I did. I did a Disney. You did Disney. Yeah, that's the big one. That's a big one. In that they own almost everything. <laughs> yeah. Now they own Mario now too. They own Mario Unless too. Unless they already did. Unclear. Yeah. We well, don't really know. I, I specifically tried to do like a, a Disney renaissance, sort of a 90s Disney interpretation. Okay, mm. nice. Should we just jump right in? Yeah. Ba, 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 ba. Let's -a go. Three, two, one, go. Because if you Google Mario Disney, there is already a very good fake Mario <gasps> Disney movie <gasps> that's like a, like a Bluth style. Maurice. Uh, Maurice. yes, I did use Maurice as a <laughs> template a for, for so Mario. Reference point. Um, so yeah, I, I was like, that one's really good on its own. Uh, so I was trying to go a different direction. So I, I tried to use more, um, post Bluth Disney, uh, characters as, as reference. Uh, Luigi is Aladdin with a mustache. <laughs> oh. Uh, because oh my. Luigi, <laughs> Luigi is protagonist shaped and Mario is sidekick shaped uh, according to like Disney shape language, uh, which is kind of the way they, they did it in um, the live action Mario where Luigi is more of the protagonist and, and Mario is, is more of a, a comic relief. It's been a while since I saw that movie, so that might not be true. But it was I, John Leguizamo. Yeah, it was John John Leguizamo <laughs> and and uh, Hoskins. Bob Hoskins. Bob Bob Skins. Hoskin Bob. Uh, so and yeah, that's like sort of a an aerial with peach hair. Cute. And then, yeah. <gasps> Uh, You're like nailing the aesthetic so hard. Yeah, Thank you. Yeah, yeah this, you really are. This is fun. I uh, I like. I, I grew up on the Disney movies, so it's it's one of those ones where it's it's fun, but it's also a lot of a lot of pressure because it's like you you know if it doesn't look right. Um, I couldn't figure out how to do how to work Bowser's like shoulder arm spikes into this design, so I, I left them out. Yeah, um, throw them away. I threw them away. Um, and yeah, so this is, I, I decided I'd just do the four, uh, characters, no, no Toad or Yoshi. Or <laughs> yeah, anything. throw them away. Um, and then, uh, yeah, I, I guess like the, like full disclosure, I, I did a bunch of like practice rounds before, oh my before God. I did the, <sighs> the actual one. I'm gonna vomit. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I'm so proud of you of, and disappointed. In a you. lot of character study and and that stuff that oh, I, I didn't end up, up recording. Um, Why am I so attracted to Luigi? Because he's Aladdin. Because he's Aladdin. He's with a mustache. He's Aladdin. he's Aladdin with a mustache. <laughs> Damn. Um, Were you not attracted to Luigi before? No, he's got that loser energy. I don't even know. <laughs> yeah, that's what I find cute. This is Luigi with a, a confidence. He's pathetic there. Here, he's confident. Damn. C couldn't be me. <laughs> <laughs> this is very fun. Yeah. Thank you. I like the big boots and pants you did, oh, too. Yeah. I, went, I went wide, wide legs, big boots. Because, again, I, I figured if, if this was like a... Like a '90s animated Mario movie, it would it would maybe have replaced the 
the 90s uh, live action Mario movie. And so borrowing a lot of the like thought processes um, from from that, except not making uh, Bowser and the Koopas look like men. <laughs> Just like horrendous people. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just Bowser, Dennis Hopper. Yeah. I want yeah. a Bowser and the Koopas band <laughs> that plays like jazz covers of Mario music. <laughs> that probably exists. Yeah, probably. I will say that when I was working on mine, I was desperately trying to confirm that the, the Goombas were in the new movie. Because I couldn't remember. And every time I Googled Mario movie Koopa, it just showed that horrible, horrible <laughs> man. <laughs> and I was so mad. <laughs> you had to look at him so much. I had to, I had to look directly at him. <laughs> I didn't ever ask for this. <laughs> Nathan, who did you reference for Bowser? Was it the Cave of Wonders? Um, it was it was a combination. So it's like the the beast yeah. and uh -huh. also Radigan a little bit. Oh, okay. And I know I know Radigan the from Great Great Mouse, Mouse Detective. Detective. Oh, Elden, I've never seen Great Mouse Detective. Okay. Pre, it's the predates Mouse the Sherlock's boyfriend. Okay, got it. Yes. Wait. They're <laughs> <laughs> having a lover's quarrel. Yeah. That's the plot of the movie. Yes. Yeah, I haven't watched it I'm in sorry, a while. I didn't mean to cut you off. <laughs> no, I, yeah. It's, uh, it's just trying to clarify. It, 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 pre it predates the, um, like, I think what's considered the Disney Renaissance, but I just really like the how shapey and, and yeah. feral I mean, looks he looks. Great. Yeah. Um, I was asking because I liked the shapes a lot. And again, I feel like. Bowser is definitely more of like a a bluthy shaped villain. Mm -hmm. Um but again, they they already that already exists online. You can find it. They did a really good interpretation. Oh, these colors. Um so I love the color you chose for the sky. It's so bright. Yeah. Very Mario-esque. Yeah, I did a, I did a combination of color picking from the the Mario movie, like the actual Mario movie poster uh and also various 90s disney movie posters and tried to sort of split the difference smart uh and then i just did a little rim lighting um because it, i i was i was in a hurry and i wanted to finish <laughs> for some reason for some reason <laughs> who could say um, never know what i did with each shading layer is i i lowered the opacity and then copied it and then the copied layer i put a, a slight blur on yeah oh. that film cell look. um smart so i did that for i, I did a, a couple different shading and, and highlight layers basically just sort of going until i was like okay i think that's enough and then i also uh took the the flats layer and um blurred it and put <gasps> it on top of the uh the lines layer but i didn't like how it it looked for for peach so i i hand did the uh the the line color for for her only how smart yeah God, this is so effective yeah it's yeah. a good like makes it look like a real film cell like i said yeah <laughs> which in modern terms sounds like a film incel which i don't Stop. like <laughs> <laughs> no one was thinking no. that <laughs> Everyone was thinking this. No one was thinking oh, that. Yes, the cloud. Yeah. yeah. The clouds. Yes. Yeah, this is a lot of just like copying layers, blurring them. That looks so cool. It came out like really spot on. Yeah. Thank yeah. you. Yeah, this is so effective. This whole piece feels so, so Disney. Yeah. It did me. Did it, me. It, it, it did me. Mario did me now. Ma Mario did me now. Um, Disney owns him too. Just like the rest of us. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> this is great. Yeah, thank great you. work. Yeah, awesome work, Nathan. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, comment down below if you think this Luigi's hotter than the other Luigi. <laughs> yeah, I want the poll going. <laughs> yeah. You know what? Actually, uh, assuming we all have drawn Luigi, how like discourse in the comments fight each other over which Luigi is the most attractive to you. I didn't draw Luigi, and I'm up next. Wow. Wow. Go on. So I'm going to go ahead and break <laughs> the pattern. <laughs> Luigi palette cleanser. Yeah. You, yeah. you won't have to think about Luigi during mine. Yeah, that's the option of I would, what are you people talking about? I wouldn't. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the studio I picked was Science Saru. <gasps> They are a Japanese studio. You probably know them best from like Devilman Crybaby. Yeah. 
Wow. From uh, I'm specifically referencing the work of Masaaki Yuasa. Yes. Who I love. Um, he did like Tatami Galaxy and uh, Mind Games and then Science Saru did like Inu O recently. Yeah. Things you might have seen. Look them up. You'll see some stuff you recognize. But the thing that I recognized, and by recognized, I mean referenced specifically, <laughs> uh -huh. was Ping Pong the Animation because I love the way that that miniseries show looks. It's Ping like pong. intentionally nasty. Yeah. It's like ugly cool. Um, so I tried to, to do that. So we'll just jump right into it. Three, two, one, go. So this one actually ended up being really fast for me because the rendering style of ping pong the animation is basically just flats. Ooh, like yeah. they don't, they do most of the work in the lines and the inks, um, which is my, uh, my wheelhouse. I see you mm -hmm. already pushing the pose. I'm pushing the pose because the kind of one of the staples of the show is that when they're playing ping pong in ping pong the animation they what? play ping pong in that is they, it animated it's animated yeah <laughs> whoa <laughs> they they push the poses so hard that they're like broken they like the the limbs stretch like into infinity as they're like reaching out to like yeah. hit the ping pong ball it's absolutely crazy That's so i awesome. wanted to try and mimic one it of those is poses one of the things i like i'm most familiar with devil man cry baby of their work um and I do love that it kind of toes the line between like very clean and like, you know, nice looking into just straight up uggo. Yes. <laughs> what my professor would call a sack of rocks. <laughs> Sometimes she would say if your work got too scrungly, she would say it looked like a sack of potatoes. And that's kind of what I think of when I see like, yeah. the animation sometimes. And I'm like, I could eat a sack of potatoes. Yeah. Mm, yeah. <laughs> that's nutrients right there. <laughs> Give me it's one filling. raw potato from that sack. <laughs> to cool me down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ping pong is like the, if you took how devil man cry baby looks and pushed it, the slider all the way up, like Hell the lines yeah. are janky. The backgrounds are like half drawn. Hell Everything's yeah. all wiggly and nasty. <laughs> uh, but I, I love the way it looks, like the energy it captures yeah. is, yeah. Uh, this is, is incredible. Great. So he's fireballing it. Yeah, he's fireballing it. This is, is I was referencing here sort of a uh, still from the show where the main character is hitting a ping pong ball. Um, but I had a feeling the pose I went with is pretty different from the one in the reference. He would hit the ping pong ball. He does it. He does it in the show. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so most of my time here is spent in the sketch and figuring out, because they do these like really scrungly black lines. Yeah. Like where the, the sort of ambient occlusion would be. Instead of like doing a light shading, they just do a big black blob wherever there would be shadow. Yeah. Um, so I was like figuring out where those would go and then figuring out how to ink it because I thought about using the scrungly brush, but when I looked closer... They actually just use like a brush with no size jitter whatsoever. Mm. And then the they ink it like in a way that the lines are not that smooth. So I had to try and make myself go a little slower so that the oh, lines yeah. weren't as smooth as I normally Ooh. make them, which was hard. Sometimes I got it. Sometimes I defaulted back to my, my normal back to way. The old of, you. Back to the old me of... <laughs> <laughs> inking fast <laughs> gotta return to the old me <laughs> yeah <laughs> it happens to the best of us this is cool yeah it was a really fun like dynamic style to mimic i love doing styles that are really pose heavy i love how loose the like overalls are just like going everywhere yeah yeah it's also fun because the stuff doesn't have to make sense yeah why are overalls so loose is because so he can take them off. He's throwing or... a fireball so hard <laughs> that his overalls are popping off. <laughs> God, I just love I love line drawing. That like, of course, it's nice to have variation in your line width, but it's it's just really cool when it's like very contour and there's. It's it's just pure line. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it's you really know what I'm fun to too. Yeah, <laughs> it's very graphic design. Yeah, it's it's like somehow clean. Yeah, despite how nonsensical some of the shapes are. Yeah, these big blocky God, shadows. That's so good. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Yeah, this one took me like an hour and sixteen minutes. Damn, wish wow. that were me. <laughs> <laughs> I I thought it was gonna take a long time, but then I was just like done. Yeah, and you started like, early on this too. I started early because I was like, I really want to do a good job. 
let me give myself plenty of time. And I was like, oh, I'm done. And then you took a big long <laughs> yeah. rest. I took a big rest. You just I took, took a nap a, took while a deep you left <laughs> running. <laughs> the heck am I doing here? Yeah, I think what? you were helping me put away groceries. <laughs> <laughs> well, if this is that was included only... in the hour? Did I yeah, not... <laughs> if this was only about an hour, then yeah, this is going to be a bit of a pause. Okay, I'm back. I'm back. <laughs> <laughs> so it was probably even less time then. I don't buy that many groceries at a time, so <laughs> it's fine. It was just almost real time. <laughs> uh, well, for me, the the most time consuming parts are always rendering because yeah. I struggle with like color and and all that stuff. Yeah, I wonder why. But po pose and and inking are what I have the most fun with, so I'm fast with those. And I didn't realize going in that this style was going to require so little rendering that it was just going to be like finished. When I just like went like and flatted yeah. in some colors, <laughs> <laughs> made that sound the entire time, yeah. pretty much. Uh, just farted in some colors. Sometimes you do. Yeah. I I want to see a Mario animation in this style now, Imagine. though. Is the thing. It would be so cool, right? Yeah. Mario's he's, like he's like crazed. It's piqued <laughs> my imagination. He's, he's not okay. <laughs> you know, he's furious. I think like something happened to Peach. <laughs> oh, I like the I like the colors. Where are you Where are you picking these colors from? I, d I didn't pick them. I Yo, just I chose them myself. He I felt them. I love the like muted red and then the mm -hmm. purple for the yeah. I was looking the at the um, at the reference image. I was looking at. I noticed that like a lot of the colors were really muted, but then the blues for some reason were really vibrant. Cool. So I just tried to mimic that sort of feel by yeah. muting the reds yeah. and having the blues pop. Oh I love gosh. cheating a color. There's something in an artist's growth when they look at a thing and they go, I know that, you know, in this case, the overalls are supposed to be blue, but to make it make sense and to make it cohesive, I'm going to make it purple. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm going to be real with you. I thought these overalls were blue. <laughs> so it was not a conscious decision on it's my like part. It's like a little... It's like Purple an indigo, yeah. yeah. It's on the cusp. It's on the cusp, but it looks fine. It's fine, they, as long as it looks good. Yeah, it looks great. <laughs> then, yeah, blue own it. you did it on purpose. Now that the You're background genius. is... You're a color genius, my guy. <laughs> <I'm> color genius. <laughs> I just can't Redder. tell, so I just pick whatever. No, nah, it looks great. Yeah. Ooh, Yo, yes. What Stop. the fuck? Good cheat. What the fuck? The star oh my gosh. <sighs> Choosing to make it soft on that inside edge. <laughs> All those so smart. stars in the background. Now I'm just thinking. He's going sicko mode. <laughs> yeah, he's invincible. He can't be stopped. <laughs> yeah, that's the word for it. But he's so angry at the same time. <laughs> he's going to use this power to hurt someone. Yeah. He's gone Good sicko him. mode. <laughs> he's going to make Bowser suffer. Yeah. <laughs> Amazing. So cool. Great work, Jacob. Thank yeah. you. Thank you. It's, yeah, yeah, it's yeah. really fun. I liked doing this style a lot. It meshed well with my own desires, so it was enjoyable. Yeah. All right. Next, we got Karina. Speaking of meshing with one's own desires, um, <laughs> I had to do Studio Trigger. <laughs> Woo! And this was a long one. Again, we love to see it. It got away from me. I mean, I'm excited to see where you went with it. I had a lot of fun with it. Let's freaking go then. Um, oh, I, I also did some preliminary like style character sketches studies before actually starting it, but I did include them in my reference layers. So you'll see, you'll, you'll see them, they suck. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> Are you ready to jump in? Yeah. Okay, three, two, one, go. Um, yeah, so this one, I was using the Mario movie poster as reference, so I did end up doing, like, most of the characters, so I, I was spent a while laying these out, figuring out what I wanted to do. Um, doing Studio Trigger kind of feels like a cop-out, because it's been such a heavy influence on my own art, like, throughout my life, since I was a youth, so... Uh, it doesn't feel like that uncomfortable for me to kind of try and like do something in that style, but nah, I was I was still futzing around with it. Uh, but th that just makes it more fun. I had a lot of fun. Yeah, it's cool to see you do a style that you've like done before. Yeah, so you I can have really done it like <laughs> go hog wild. Yeah, but I'm doing it better now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, it's cool to see the growth. You know? yeah. yeah, that's what I'm saying. Because yeah. I, I did it for I think our One Piece speed draw. I did Studio Trigger. 
And that one I did more in the style of Gurren Log on eye catches, but um, I I also kind of rushed it, so I wasn't too pleased with it. This one I was like, now nah, we're, we're gonna take our time. We're gonna we're gonna go we're gonna go a little silly. We're gonna go do 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 do. <laughs> <laughs> and um, yeah, my Luigi, I wanted to lean more into pathetic. <laughs> I just think he's cute. <laughs> it is pretty cute. My Luigi. <laughs> Um, oh but yeah, God. I think those are so strong. <laughs> uh, I couldn't, <laughs> you'll, you'll notice that I don't know. I keep changing and like changing my mind about how I want to draw toad. <laughs> oh my God. This Donkey Kong is so cute. <laughs> yes, <laughs> I futz around with him, but I could not decide what way I wanted to draw a toad. <laughs> it was really, really, cause he, he has like a, cause like with, with trigger, it kind of goes from like, you know, moe to like badass to like, kind of just like a weird little guy. Yeah. And toad is like such a weird little guy, but it read better on the moe <laughs> angle. <laughs> but I was like, but I want him to be a weird little guy. And then I had trouble drawing Donkey Kong too, because I thought that first sketch was really cute, but then I kind of changed the design a little. Whatever. <laughs> um, He's such a strong guy. <laughs> I think Donkey Kong's strong. Yeah. I get the feeling. Donkey <laughs> Kong, Donkey him. Strong. Yeah. And then and then Good. this this fucking dude. <laughs> Who cares? Kamek. Or but yeah, Kamek. And here's where I struggle. Because <laughs> I wanted him to be weird, but it just like didn't fit <laughs> so i kept changing i kept changing like which artist uh from the studio and which character i was using before i kind of landed on something where i was like whatever <laughs> it's toad <laughs> i love I your kamek though thank you and then this is that was the sketch <laughs> god and um i see why this took so long again well, it's because it was a thousand characters i mean unlike you i don't like doing the line art like i started this and i wanted there to be a lot of like line with variation and then i was like actually no so um i i get rid of all this oh my god <laughs> shortly um delete your art delete yeah your art fuck heavy it one this time I, yeah. i'm gonna warn you now this is not the first one so <laughs> 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 you better save save your shit because i delete more later <laughs> but um i wanted to keep it a little bit less like variable because you know so depending on which artist is kind of running whatever production it's on there, there's different levels of like real zaniness or like graphic quality to the art but uh with this one i i was trying to go more uh pro mare inspired like the newer stuff so it was trying to be a bit cleaner <sighs> but yeah i really I love like the, i love the luigi face by the way thank you i like this peach yeah this peach is very good i had to give her the big <laughs> Uh, <laughs> well, because I, I, I've been like such a fan. I was like the Gynax boobs. <laughs> yeah. And I was like, oh, right. They're not that anymore. <laughs> the honking Hondas. The honking Hondas. Beep, beep. <laughs> She's here. It's what she deserves. <laughs> I like yeah. that she looks strong and confident. Yeah. Like she's in charge of the situation. This is the most I've ever liked Peach, and I dislike <laughs> Peach. <laughs> She's a very technical character in Smash Bros. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> Let him speak. Let him speak. <laughs> Was she doing a float cancel there? <laughs> you shouldn't have let him speak. <laughs> okay, I take it back. Silence I'm done. him. <laughs> I'm done. Um, and I'm, I'm doing my flipping because f- fuck you. He's <laughs> dancing. Yeah, I made I, I I pushed him to be more of like the the cutesy the cutesy archetype <laughs> i just i wanted him to be such a little guy but i guess comic is the or the weird little guy i guess that's comic he's he's Com- nasty comic does look like he's like a little pervert in those yeah corners. he's yeah. the one that like he will break into like the four frame per second like animations you know <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> There's always one. There's always one, okay? Yeah. Um, but yeah, so I, I just it just took a while to do the line art on this one because eh. it's a lot. It's a lot. 
You drew a lot of things. I drew, and all I those drew things so many things. Have and lines. for why? For why? Because it rules. Because it's awesome. Thank you. And yeah. And slaps. Just to throw down all the coolers. Did you also go. Because <laughs> you flatted them in? <laughs> yeah, kind of. Nice. <laughs> um, so yeah. And uh, to do the shading, whenever I start that. I wanted it to be kind of like cell shading, but because I've spent, I've, I've done my time in the <laughs> Promare fan art gulag. <laughs> um, <laughs> the way that they do that is that each section is shaded with a different color. Like if you did a multiply layer, like the the whites are shaded differently than the yellows or shaded differently than the reds, etc. And then I, I just like didn't have it in me to fully do that, but I, I did like one like shading layer so that I could adjust it individually later. <laughs> so oh, that's why I was doing smart. it this way instead of like, uh, you, you, know, you, you know, it's yeah. it's the usual cell shading, but then I went and changed it later, but I, I did it. I did it the way <laughs> got that anime production look. <laughs> yeah, it does. <laughs> <laughs> but um, more on that later. Every time I see Luigi, I just think about the time that Nathan wanted to defeat that luigi guy at anime nyc i did not want to defeat him i wanted to (laughs) i I had no illusions about defeating him i just thought it would be fun to get my ass beat by him Mm -hmm. okay interesting (laughs) um but yeah so then did the shading and then did a lot of color adjustments to make it look real cool and sexy and uh, I wanted it to have more of a warm thing, but like I said, uh, the the way to really like make it look cool is to like shade the whites with a blue. So I, I go and do that later to really make it pop. And then I did the line art. I colored the line art. In, yeah, you by did. hand <laughs> this is a labor intensive process there's a way like there are auto actions to color the line art but it's just kind of like you know guest like, you know approximate it yeah. just looks better if you do it yourself no it totally does <laughs> so that's what i did <laughs> and yeah and then change the shadows to like the gloves and the eyes and anything else that's like basically pure white or something to a cooler color to give it make it look more juicy Make it look cool. Juice, juice. Juice. I'm thirsty. Yeah. Well, yeah. So that's how I got the colors to look like they do in Promare. (laughs) And I just got real creative with the whatever colors I was making things. I was just like, fuck it. Yeah. (laughs) I never noticed that shading thing before, but now that you've pointed it out. The blue shading? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and it's it's because, you know, like uh, it makes the white look brighter if it's offset with like a, a blue especially and i just wanted to do like a bunch of like silly shits in the background i i just like didn't have it in me to do any like like draw a cityscape or anything so i started filling everything in with like all of these fucking like trigger-esque shapes like the (laughs) freaking that guy yeah and um and there's a star and then i was just like not feeling it i was like i don't know what the fuck i'm doing i don't know how i feel about any of this and I just start adding shit and being like, no, it doesn't feel correct. Um, so then I just like delete everything at the bottom. <laughs> oh, really? Oh, yeah. I thought they were good. Thank you. But I I kind of preferred the triangular composition. So I wanted oh, to fill out the top and then yes. leave the bottom kind of oh, open. Yeah. Have all the attention up by yeah. Bowser. I think that I does that. actually kind of work better. Yeah. You're right. So yeah. then that's how I ended it. <laughs> Ta-da. That's awesome. God, that's so cool. <laughs> that's so yeah. cool. Thank you. <laughs> that's just really like good. Sick poses, sick shading, <laughs> sick character design. I'm gonna barf. <laughs> I'm gonna barf I'm all sick. over this. I'm yeah, can you sick. turn to the right so that you're barfing on Nathan I'm and not me? I'm gonna barf on Nathan. I'm Thank gonna you. do it. Thank you. <laughs> God, that Luigi. True, you truly made him so pathetic. Yeah, I love it. I love him. <laughs> Amazing. Uh, thank you. This is awesome. Great work, Karina. <laughs> yeah, you. you really got like, just based on the trailers, I feel like you really got the characterization, sort of what they're going for in this in this that's, Mario That's what movie. I was aiming for. Yeah. It was really largely referencing like the movie poster. Yeah. Similar, 
similar hierarchy of characters. <laughs> Hell yeah. But yeah, it was fun. Thank you. Very good. We got Julia up last. Woo! Me. Julia, what <laughs> studio did you do? Uh, so I kept joking. Nathan Nathan had asked a question earlier that day of what's what's relevant, what are the kids into these days? And I kept saying Wallace and Gromit at him for no reason. <laughs> it was just like the first thing that came to my brain. Why? And then when we were deciding the speed draw, I was like, I don't know what studio to do. And Nathan was like, Ardman Studios is right there. <laughs> and I was like, oh, yeah. <laughs> Uh, so I did um, a Wallace and Gromit style. I will say, you as, sculpted them out of clay. As, <laughs> as per usual, I um, I really done goofed it. What do you mean? I'm so excited to see what that means. Yeah, well, actually, don't tell me. Okay, we can. Well, I want to say at the gate that I forgot the prompt was specifically because the Mario movie was coming out. Uh huh. So I did <laughs> Luigi's Mansion. <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah, I if, only did Luigi. If Hardman Studios did the Mario movie, they would have done yeah, Luigi's Mansion. They would, they would delete what? Mario. <laughs> Mario is missing uh, from yeah. this movie. That's the sequel. Shall we jump in? Uh, yeah. Okay. Three, two, one, go. I truly did a me. <laughs> Me trying to figure so out strong. how a stupid head's gonna work. <laughs> God, I love it. <laughs> so that's me trying to build out my Luigi, and then um, Nathan joked. No, Julia. Yeah. Nathan joked, but it's true. Oh, God. Go uh, on. I made it. I made it out of clay. She made a real ass Luigi. No. So I'm last this episode because you I knew this. I spent the most time on this. This this does take the new record for amount of time spent. Oh my goodness. On a speed How long draw. did it spend? The whole thing, including photographing it, which you'll see at the end, <laughs> is 18 hours. Yo. <laughs> it was like days of labor. <laughs> it I did spend three days. That's so funny. <laughs> um, I'm so excited. <laughs> Wait. That means he's in this house. He's he here. is in this he's house. Here. Where is he? Where? He's, he's in the bedroom hiding. He's in the bedroom. Yeah, I'll I'll pull him out after <laughs> we're done recording. He's kind of in pieces right now because you'll see why. <laughs> he got so scared, he exploded. Look at his little head at the bottom. It's yeah. cracking me up. Um, yeah, it I looks had like to a bake. mighty beans. I forgot to buy white clay, so I wound up having to. I, I'm using Sculpty, by the way. Yeah. Um, I baked his eyeballs and then painted them white. Um, and I had to do that with a few pieces. I had to paint. Uh, I'm making some some armature wire because I. I wanted to pose him to be standing like in my sketch. Yeah. Uh, here's, here's Joy, who decided to hang out with me for a little while. She was just watching me oh, for like 20 minutes. Baby. <laughs> just enjoying the process. She was just enjoying the process. She didn't disturb me at all. And then she just left. It was very cute. Aww. Um. Yeah. I wind up scrapping the whole armature system because. Of course. Uh, and then here's Olive <laughs> in her orange. <laughs> What a delight. Yeah, it was very cute. You can see her in the corner up there. It's it's very <laughs> sweet. Uh, you'll see them a lot. Sculpting Luigi's touche. So gotta. I used armature wire um, for a little while, and then I just ripped Luigi off of the armature wire because I didn't like how it was coming out. So I decided to use a, a system of toothpicks to attach each appendage. Okay. Uh, there's Jacob. There's me. We were ordering dinner, I think, at that time. You can see the lights subtly changing <laughs> yeah. as, as time goes on. Yeah. This is so much, Julia. <laughs> it's what yeah. he deserves. <laughs> um, yeah, here's me trying to sculpt his, his stupid little head. I added hair on top of his head. Um, and it, his hairline, because I'm going to cover it with a hat, which I'm making right now, is very funny. Here's Joy just watching. Joy, I'm trying to watch. Don't be greedy. 
I'm sculpting. I couldn't figure out. I kept walking up to Jacob and being like, does this look stupid? Like trying to figure out Mario's hat on top of his head shape. That's Luigi. Yeah, the Mario. He's green, he's green Mario. Green Mario. I was trying to figure out green Mario's hat on top of this wall and Gromis head. <laughs> Wall and Gromis. <laughs> wall and Gromis. Wall and Gromis. Wall and Gromis. Wall and Gromis. Wall and Gromis, you know. Yeah, from the movie. I added like <laughs> his little hairballs. You can see it at the bottom. His head's on a stake right now. Oh, I love the shape of his head. I love <laughs> the shape of you. <laughs> <laughs> Don't let Ed Sheeran see this. <laughs> He's going to lust after Luigi. <laughs> uh, here's me constructing the bod. There's Olive in her new cone. Um, Orange wasn't ass. cutting it. <laughs> Orange wasn't cutting it. She's now the planet Saturn. Uh, here's here's Luigi doing a steppy. Oh. I had to bolster his leg on a, like a thing of sculpty that I wasn't using. Yeah. Um, kind of like how they tell you to sleep if you sleep on your side, put a pillow there. That's what I was doing. It was kind of cute. Keeping Luigi comfy. Yeah, yeah, keeping Luigi comfy, mostly so that you you'll see once I attach the arms that he starts like sagging because he wasn't oh, baked. No. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then I had to construct like a system of how to keep him standing. <laughs> <laughs> you can see him start leaning. This is incredible. Um, <laughs> no, get back here. <laughs> <laughs> stacking there more goes. shit. <laughs> uh, I'm painting his teeth because I baked his head. Nice. Uh, I also painted the little part of his hat. Um, I'm making the uh, ghost backpack. Yeah, thing. from the movie. Yeah, from the movie. <laughs> <laughs> I bought these little um, glass jars. Uh, they're supposed to be like potion jars, but oh. I used it to, you know, make the little backpack part yeah. where all the ectoplasm goes. You can see he's doing. You can see him in the corner. <laughs> 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 he has no pupils. <laughs> no pupils yet, because I couldn't. I wanted to paint them on, but I wanted to like see how we would photograph him before deciding where his pupils would go. <laughs> looking at you like why yeah <laughs> grant me sight mother <laughs> please I, at this point he's baked uh i've made Good him little hands him. but again i forgot to buy white so i made them flesh tone and then i wind up having to paint it <laughs> he has no neck he currently just has a toothpick this is the next day the you next my day space. the neck day the neck day <laughs> <laughs> There he is. He's doing his little steppy. I was very proud of the fact that he was standing on his own without tipping over. <laughs> oh, there's a, there's a pupil. It's gone. I, I attached a pupil and then I decided that I I didn't like it and I couldn't attach the second pupil without it falling over. So I, so I decided I was going to paint it later. Uh, I'm painting his little backpack because I also forgot to buy red. <laughs> and I had some enamel paints from uh, when I paint my Gundams. Hell yeah. Um. So I made him a background because it's me. Yeah. Yeah. And I can't have a, a scene without a background. I mean, that's that's fun. But where else are you going to stand in your living room? <laughs> He's too small. <laughs> construction is my favorite part of anything. I love to construct. So here I am painting individual floorboards. Um, I'm painting some floorboards uh, in sort of a lighter tone. Uh, I had to cut. I bought like a bunch of. I went to the art store and the lady looked at all the things I was buying and she just goes, what are uh, you making? Making a Luigi's Mansion, huh? In the art <laughs> style? Yeah. Another one. <laughs> she was so baffled. What's she going to be baffled about? It's lady. an art store. Yeah. <laughs> what are you looking she at? Like, Mind you... your own business. Well, old. I just told her straight up and I was like, I'm making a Wallace and Gromit Luigi. And she was like, Wallace and Okay. Don't ask <laughs> questions you don't want the answers to, old I'm, lady. I'm sure she's just used to seeing the combination of things people are buying and being like, I have a good idea of what they're trying yeah. to do. And yeah. saw your combo and was like, what is this? <laughs> um, so I wanted the Luigi Mansion, uh, like floorboards are kind of like ripped apart at some points, but I made them further apart for when we photograph it then you'll mm -hmm. actually see it because if you make it any closer then it won't like photograph well it'll yeah. just look like a normal floorboard uh i'm making some windows here for one of the walls i'm painting it dark it's supposed to be like um a room that's being gutted sort of thing wall and gromis 
Wall, wall, wall and grommets. That's the wall. <laughs> That's the wall. Where's the grommets? Yeah. Where's the grom? Where's the grommets? <laughs> um, yeah. Th- so this is the assembly. I had to build it somewhat technically correct, or else my construction dad would kill me. Uh, so the <laughs> the vertical uh, wood planks are solid, and the horizontal ones are broken up. Not you staining the floor. <laughs> I'm staining For the wood. Authenticity. <laughs> I'm staining the wood. I love it. Um, I put in um purple like coloring paper or construction paper uh, on the window so that if I put a light behind there, it would give it like a spooky glow. The crazy energy of you just like, <laughs> and the placemat is just sliding away. <laughs> yeah. I love this. this I want to do this now. It's It was very fun. It did hurt my back. Um, I imagine knowing yeah. what where you are sitting. Yeah, yeah, you're you're crazy for that. Yeah, <laughs> where the hell have you been, Loka? <laughs> <laughs> this um, is so cool. Thank you. Yeah, I'm I'm putting in some little background details, um, some little some little horizontal planks. Uh, I decided to make a little table. <laughs> To put in the scene. You gotta. Yeah. <laughs> Ties the room together. Yeah, I, I was just wondering, some, like, where's the table? Yeah, I was, I was using like, some cardboard scraps. I'm gonna scream and piss if there is an, if he's in an unfurnished room. Yeah, <laughs> to be a... fair, I wanted to make some, like, spider webs. Oh, this is me starting. I'm lighting it up. So I'm doing some cable work. Yeah, My you gotta, God. You gotta, I'm doing you some get electrical, electrical work. work in, yeah, of course. So I bought some um, three God. volt LED, micro LEDs. So and much. I used to have to make extension cables with my dad and run uh, electrical through some buildings. So this was nice to go back to the old me <laughs> of having a construction job. This is... This cost you money. Yeah, it like did. there was a budget for this speed draw. This is yeah. <laughs> this is speed draw. <laughs> speed sculpt. I do love a good construction, Julia. It's my happy place. I love yeah. to build with wood and wires. It's I'm going back to my childhood <laughs> of having to do construction. Work. Many people don't know this, but uh at my old apartment, Julia helped fix my ceiling <laughs> one time because yeah. there was a big ass hole in it and no one would repair it. So Julia came and did it. <laughs> this um, is so fun. Jacob was helping me figure out where we were going to place Luigi in the photo so that I could hide the cables. Originally, I was going to hide it through his body, through his foot, but then the armature wire wasn't working out and then I would have to like insert another one and I didn't know how wide like the cables were going to wind up being, so... <laughs> Um, but I wanted his backpack to light up and for him to use his little flashlight. Oh my god! So that's yeah! what he looks like. Yeah. <laughs> that's Julia, what he wound up looking perfect. like. Perfect. That's incredible. Wow. Hey, Ardman, Ard Man. Ard, Ard, Ard man. Are Ard you man? Mr. Man. <laughs> yeah. If you hadn't done that table, I don't think it would have worked. Yeah. <laughs> and then I was using the little jars I bought. Yeah. 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 And um, the little spare popsicle sticks. Yeah. And then I used, there's a lot of cardboard, like scrap, cardboard scraps. I tried to use like a lot of stuff i had around yeah already. this is so cool so, i want to do this here's my stupid luigi i feel like i love your stupid luigi I thank feel you like people are gonna request more of this oh, sort no. of thing sculpt don't <gasps> yeah. i want to sculpt <laughs> bad news <laughs> i want to do it <laughs> we'll do a karina sculpt oh. episode <laughs> maybe me i don't know yeah i have to yeah. let my back recover maybe i'll sculpt yeah, too you I need can... to sit in a proper <laughs> seat the amount of laying in on the floor i did after this just like wanting my back to settle uh, was a lot <laughs> you literally just need a table <laughs> yeah a normal height table yeah and we can do it impossible <laughs> but um, yeah, so the cables, there's a micro LED um, in like the hole in the side of the backpack. And I, since it's like wire, you can manipulate it to kind of curve around and it's sticking into the glass of the backpack. Hell yeah. And then um, the flashlight is actually the cables wrapped in silver uh, sculpty. And Hell then there's a yeah. piece of tin foil that I, I turned into a cone and I stuck it into the clay. <laughs> and then the cables are running behind his two legs and through a hole in the floor. 
And when I took the photo, Jacob and I um, put it on top of two folding chairs. And so, and we like spaced out the chairs. Yeah. <laughs> One of the Karina chairs. I helped. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, then I attached the, the batteries then. And then wow. like taped it with Amazing. electrical tape. And we held up the uh, the sun the sun lamp. Oh yeah, we have a sun lamp <laughs> to illuminate the windows from the I outside. Love yeah, this. Jacob we, helps like, me photograph. We closed and... all the curtains in the bedroom and just like uh, this took is pictures. So cool. <laughs> I used to do shit like this in high school. Now I really want to do it again. Can we please do it? It was fun. We can do it. We'll give Julia a break, <laughs> and then we surely please. we can do it. Yes. Best. Um, yeah, I wanted to make um, hot glue gun spider webs, uh, but the test I was doing, I, I didn't like how it looked, so I scrapped it. But I think you did enough. I think yeah, I did I enough. Think, <laughs> yeah, I think you can calm down now. Yeah, for this one, I think you did enough. Yeah. This yeah. is my clay Ouija. Wow. Yeah. Clay Ouija. Clay Ouija. Damn, I gotta say, banger episode, y'all. Yeah. yeah. I feel like we Everyone all came through on this one. Yeah, for, for Luigi. For we, Luigi. We did it for Luigi. Luigi. We, we got yeah. Aladdin Luigi, no Luigi, <laughs> pathetic Luigi, and Clay Luigi. I prefer poor little Meow Meow. <laughs> if, you, if you didn't think I was going to whole ass the wrong prompt, you were wrong. Because I would... I, I, put so much effort into doing the wrong prompt. <laughs> it was so funny to me. <laughs> Jacob pointed it out like while I was like starting to make it and I went, oh no, <laughs> you're right, the prompt. I feel like it works. There's definitely, they're definitely gonna refer to Luigi's house mansion. In Luigi's house. Luigi's house. <laughs> Luigi's house in the movie. Yeah, In some surely. capacity. Yeah, and Ardman, and it's gonna look a little something like this. Yeah, <laughs> Ardman would have gone all out with that part. Yeah, yeah. So you all did it. it's missing is Gromit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Awesome oh, work, wow. Julia. Awesome work, everyone. Woo. I'm I'm watching Karina's and Julia's back to back. I'm just like tired vicariously. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> Wowie wow. If you liked this, and I know you did if you watched it, yeah, then you better click like. This isn't free. Yeah. Click like. Yeah. I mean, we, need to, we need to pay for all the art supplies we bought yeah. for this episode. Yeah. You yeah. saw it. We got you no saw money. it. That's going to cost you one click, please. We spent everything. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, please like and subscribe. And if you want to support more endeavors where we might have to spend money to do it, uh, if, you, if you support us on Patreon, we'll have money to spend. Wow. Yes. Art supplies is expensive. That's why we typically do digital. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Uh, we've also got merch in the store. You can support us by buying that and have cool clothes. Yeah. And we stream on Monday nights on Twitch, 7 p.m. Eastern time. And maybe Luigi will be there. Yeah. Maybe. Thanks for watching, everyone. We're sorry. <laughs> sorry. 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 <laughs>